Our liver is a very complex organ that is involved in almost all of its functions. The liver both stores energy and produces proteins. It is the largest gland in our body. It also serves as a filter that neutralizes toxins. In addition, the liver is the second largest organ right after the skin, but very often this filter breaks down. A bad environment, poor diet, alcohol, and some medicines, all these things are destructive to our liver. And very often, there can be problems, especially often it starts after the age of 50. But the good news is that the liver is a unique organ that can heal itself. Even if only 25% of its volume is left, it can completely regenerate and grow back. Even when donors sacrifice half of their liver, it eventually returns completely to its original state. Amazing, isn't it? So this knowledge gives us optimism. In this video, I'm going to tell you about the warning signs that our liver is giving us that should not be ignored. And if you find these signs in yourself, you certainly shouldn't panic. You just need to know something to take further action to get better. So watch the video to the end. It will be very interesting and useful. Here we go. By the way, be sure to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell. That way you will not miss our new videos. What are the main risk factors that lead to liver disease? First of all, it's being overweight because being overweight is usually accompanied by impaired lipid metabolism, and this can lead to fatty liver degeneration. Consumption of large amounts of fatty and fried foods and also sugar, glucose and fructose. Heredity also has an effect. If you have someone in your family suffering from liver disease, this can affect the likelihood that you will also have the same problems. So what are the main causes that cause liver problems? The number one cause is alcohol, because the products of alcohol processing, acetaldehyde, damage liver cells. Although much of the sensitivity to the effects of alcohol is programmed in us genetically, nevertheless, doctors say that consuming more than 30 grams of ethanol per day will strain the liver many times over. It's one ounce. And if you take 50 grams of pure alcohol, it is already the strongest poison for the liver. Also, the health of our liver is very much affected by such a thing as viruses. This is the hepatitis virus, and viruses cannot manifest themselves in any way. But a person can be their carrier and transmitter. Also, a very common thing is the stagnation of bile. This occurs either due to some innate functional peculiarities or improper diet and lifestyle. Well, what are the main symptoms that can tell us about liver disease and which should not be ignored in any way? First, usually the symptoms that are associated with liver disease will be increased fatigue and weakness, decreased performance, a feeling of apathy, and a decline in cognitive abilities such as memory, concentration, and so on. If you feel this kind of thing, it could be indicative of problems specifically in the liver. Because this all goes along with auto-intoxication, and so a diseased liver directly affects your general well-being and motivation charge. The next very indicative sign is various skin changes. Because due to the release of bile acids through the surface of the skin, we can see signs of this disease. Very characteristic will be the manifestation of these peculiar red vessels in the form of spiders. Most often, these spiders appear either on the cheeks or on the wings of the nose, and the surface of the palms may turn red. Also, fatty spots on the skin, discoloration of the tongue, and thick plaque may appear on the tongue. And another characteristic sign you have a red tip of the tongue. The skin can be a huge change. It is a well-known yellowing which can speak of hepatitis. By the way, hepatitis comes in both viral and non-viral forms. Also, the skin may become dry and pigment spots may appear on it. Brittle nails and hair can also be a sign of liver problems. Another very telling sign is bags under the eyes. Another sign of liver problems can be varicose veins. Oddly enough, this problem is often rooted in the liver. There is even such an interesting nuance here. Sometimes a person has hemorrhoids because of a diseased liver. Of course, this is not always the main leading cause, but this factor is present. If you have any of these signs, you need to see a doctor. Do not do self-treatment, go to a specialist who will help you. And what are the main recommendations for prevention and how to maintain a healthy liver so as not to lead to trouble? 
In terms of nutrition, you need to limit alcohol as well as anything fatty. Even worse if it's deep fried. Various cakes and pastries are also all bad for your liver. From a lifestyle, you need to watch your health and keep a hepatitis B and C prevention routine. Wash your hands and remember that hepatitis is sexually transmitted. And in general, gastroenterologists recommend every year to make an ultrasound of the abdominal organs. Since we may not suspect, but often the gallbladder can accumulate bile, then a gastroenterologist should prescribe appropriate treatment. And now, I highly recommend that you watch our other video where I talk about how to preserve our vision after 50 years of age. It's very important. The link to the video just appeared on the screen, and I left a link in the description as well. And I've also pinned the link in the top comment. Be sure to watch it. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. See you in the video about how to preserve your vision after 50 years of age.